Aries, welcome to your solar eclipse reading, and this solar eclipse is in your sign, so buckle up, big changes for you, this is hitting your first house, having to do with your sense of self, your identity, and so you could get a new beginning, I just saw a queen of swords there, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini might be relevant, but it could also have to do with the way you think, the way that you communicate, okay? I think you have a brand new start really on a very personal level. I'm hearing reinventing, reinventing yourself, okay? Let's, oh, we've already got a jumper. Let's see what that is. That was the Queen of Cups in reverse. So, um, you know, there might be some issues of codependency, emotional insecurity, at play in your life. Let's see, um, what are the opportunities with this solar eclipse? What are the opportunities for this solar eclipse for Aries? We've got the Emperor in reverse, King of Pentacles in reverse, Ace of Wands in the upright. So I really feel like, look, there's that brand new beginning, but wait a second. Are there trust issues, particularly surrounding a masculine? And I'm sorry to say this could be you, Aries. It could also be in our sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So, you know, maybe somebody in your life is presenting you a new opportunity uh, with a creative passion a project. Could be a new sexual union for some of you. Others travel. Um, but I really think that some of you, this might be how you put your passions out there, okay? If uh, there have been trust issues with men, um, men trying to control everybody but themselves, I'm sorry to say, out of control men, my God, there is an opportunity to begin again and um, to light a fire. And I'm hearing light a match on that, light a match on that, Okay. The challenges that you are having here is, oh, sweet Jesus. Well, there's a fool in reverse and a star card in reverse. So Aries, possibly Aquarius is relevant. I'm seeing possibly a false start here or something is not really taking off or it didn't take off, um, possibly involving you or this Aquarian, all right? Or if it's not an Aquarian, it's a soulmate. And there might be some issues now of having a lack of faith, um, maybe some hopelessness, a lack of healing over this. Uh, and somebody maybe even feeling that they were um, not recognized, okay? There's a loss of ambition there, all right? So that is kind of a challenge some of you need to, I'm hearing begin again, it's on the table, but you're gonna have to find your faith again, all right? So that you can find your faith, your feet and take that leap of faith, all right? That's the blockage. Let's see what the action is that you're being asked to take. What action is Aries being asked to take? We've got Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Four of uh, wands in reverse and the knight of cups in reverse and the queen of pentacles. This is a lot of look. <laughs> oh boy. Um, some of you need to pass on an opportunity and it might have to do with housing, home, family, sense of belonging. Um, leaving the home is what I'm seeing here. Um, and, and, and not hesitating. Okay. With this knight of wands that's your energy or another fire sign aries leo sagittarius that i'm seeing and our sign female possibly with the queen of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn you know somebody here might be using their finances to have access or influence and it's not healthy okay it's not healthy at all and so i think the advice is that you need to leave that okay you need to stop i'm here and stop dilly dallying around at the foundation well with the three of swords you need to um 
deal with some loyalty issues and I'm sorry to say if there's been three party situations in sexual unions because of mistrust, somebody getting too greedy. All right. And now, um, there's a lack of faith in, in unions or a union. Okay. Um, this needs to be turned in the reverse. Okay. I see a lot of deep dissatisfaction tied to the disloyalty issues, uh, divided loyalties. Okay. Three party situations, however it is that has created separation. Um, and, and I really feel that for some of you, the issue is you maybe need to choose to separate yourself from something different than what you have in the past. Please tell me more about this solution. Please tell me more about this solution of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles. This might have to do with dependency issues, okay? If, hmm. And somebody giving something, maybe child support. Um, but I'm also seeing a gift here being given in order for you to get a new start. So you, I think you have to choose wisely in terms of what it is that you are going to um, give yourself to, to get a new beginning. I feel like um, the action you need to take is leave something behind that maybe you were giving yourself to or was giving to you in the past, but um, it's created separation. It's created division. It's created a loss of faith in your life. Your advice is going beyond normal. I think it's breaking out of this everyday life that you've been in and, um, you know, understand that you're going through a perfection process, right? I'm hearing a refining process, the refining fires, okay? And some of you need to, like I said, begin again, take that leap of faith, turn this in the upright, right? Overcome this challenge by believing again in something, all right? And taking advantage of the potential to have a new sexual union, a new creative project, a new passion project, a new beginning here. It's all on the table here, I can see. But you're going to have to get beyond your normal every day, the way that you've been doing things, and realize that life is perfecting itself. Hope that helps you. Wishing you the best, Aries. Be blessed.